So in today's quick little short video, I'm just going to do a quick test on painting uh, copper with hammerite. So I've got a piece of copper split in half because one half we're going to paint with this uh, special metals primer. The other half is going to go straight on with hammerite. I'm going to see if there's any difference, whether you need the primer, how much of a difference it actually makes. So there we are, we're putting the primer on. Make sure I put a really nice good coat on. Now we're going to paint just straight on with the hammer out on the other side while we let the primer dry. So both the primer and the hammer out have gone on, they've gone on really well, really easy to paint on. No problems there at all. The test is going to be how well they adhere and how well they stick to the copper. So I've left this piece of copper outside over a good few weeks outside in British winter. It's been frosty, it's been wet, it's got snow on it. So it's been through the elements. I'm going to just get a wooden peg see how well it's stuck the paint as you can see on the primer side it is coming off it is chipping off definitely but it's not too bad and the primer underneath is sticking really well but then we go on to the copper side and it's just not adhered at all it's not stuck a little bit so as you can see shortly i'll start pulling at those bits that i've taken off and it just peels completely off so that is not stuck to the copper at all so i definitely rec recommend using primer So the primer I used was the Hammer Art's own Special Metals Primer, which has definitely helped. It seems to have uh, etched into the surface of the copper quite well and then the paint. Not a perfect adhesion on top, but it's a lot better than the raw copper. So if you are planning this, I would definitely recommend using the primer.